research about black history. And one of our main things that we always get information on is through oral tradition. So we came from African griots performing and things of that nature. So I said, you know, let me go back to history. That's how we educate our people back in the day. So it still works for today. So what are you trying to do as far as impacting everybody with your spoken word? How do you think it's really going to help out this devastation that we have? Well, I realized that the, the voice is very powerful. So what I did was I created an organization called the National AIDS Words Poets, full of other poets that use their voices as well to educate people about HIV. And I realized that this particular virus, is that's what it's missing, because many people are silent. So 